Hello my friends, it's Roy has welcome back to another episode of Axe Valley Evolved. You know what? I've been incredibly lucky. Over here, uh, where's this actually? It's here on the map. Uh, very north-ish. North -ish. I found a female Gigantonotosaurus or Giganotosaurus. I always pronounce it correctly, right? And I wanna tame her. At least I'm trying. 80 arrows left. I already put like 100 arrows into her. I hope she will get sleepy real soon. Yeah! That didn't, didn't take so long. Now, um, now let's see if I can park my, my quasl. Like so, I think that should work, right? Yeah! Okay, quickly give you some food. <laughs> That's not food, I know. Give you people. Pump you full of... Pump you full of uh, narcotics. This is, this is incredibly close. <laughs> and incredibly hard. He loses his topo. She loses the topo so quickly. But I think now... Yeah! Giga, Giga, just call you Giga. Nice. And she buries me again. But I can get out. Okay. Cool. Follow me, man. Follow me. We are going home. Okay, I can see totally fine. And we are there. Finally, we made it. Hey, can I ride you? Okay, I can. So, we've got a pair of Giganotosaurus. And now what I'm trying to do... Let's see if I can do that. Let's make her stand in here. I think once they are in here, they should not be able to move out again, right? Uh, yes, I think that... It's gonna be okay. Okay, now try to ride you. Okay, can I move? Okay. Let's try to move you into there, into this little pit. I call it the laugh pit for obvious reasons. Okay. And now, once I have touched or hit the ground, okay, there we go. Let's get inside. Let's see. Um, but yeah. Uh, enable wandering. She should not be able to move. Enable wandering. Uh, no. You're not supposed to move away from me. That's not good. Stop it. Okay, my friends. You don't seem to fit into my little laugh box. So I have to document against that. Can I craft another one? No. Okay. We'll live. So let's see. I have a feeling this thing is a bit too small. And you guys are stuck inside each other, is that right? Oh man, this fall damage. I need to I need to I need a way to actually circumvent against this fall damage. It's so this fall damage is so uber. There's way too much fall damage. You need a safe way to get down from it. From this big animal. Okay, can we turn around? We can. Let's see if you get stuck inside. I think I need a bigger one. <laughs> this is way too small. You are willing to breed, I hope. Okay. Now you should be stuck inside that thing, right? Let's enable wandering. Don't follow me anymore. And here it is. Good. Success. Actually, before they finish mating, let's level you up. I want more. Let's say yeah, melee damage maybe. I hope this doesn't this doesn't interrupt mating. No. Hello. <laughs> Look at the size of this egg. Wow, it's ginormous. And it's too cold. Thank you, my dear. 
When when can she, when when can she mate again? I wonder. Uh, in six hours. Okay. The incubator. So I'm going to toss this egg on the ground like this. Um, too cold. Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> Good. Yeah, and it's incubating. I think that's gonna take a little bit of time, I guess. I don't know. Hello. Wow. Your body is a bit weird. Yeah, accept it. First, let's actually accept it and give you some meat instantly so you don't die on me, even though you have like over 7,000 health. Um, let's turn that off. Now let's see if you can actually follow me. Come on, let's go out. Okay, good. Good, good, good. He made it out. So, this little cutie here is our new baby. He looks so cute. Um, but his body is a bit weird here, like this is all just pushed together. Uh, yeah. What gender are you? A male. Hmm, I was hoping for a female. But that's okay. We love you. Dude, I've just noticed. This guy requires so much food. Yes, of course, he has to get big and strong, but <laughs> this guy requires so much food. I've noticed he got, like, uh, bleeding, he got wounds. That's because... This thing ran out of food. We are currently freezing because we are here in the ice biome and... Um, look what we've got. I brought him here with the Pteranodon. And, yeah. Kairuku, Kairuku. Um, you can, unfortunately, you cannot tame them by putting food in your last um, food bar and like approach them. Unfortunately, a violentless uh, taming thing would be nice, but yeah, it's it's like it is. So those guys eat f eat meat instead of berries, which I. Oops. That's strange. I mean, I've got the organic polymer. <laughs> you don't eat that stuff, by the way. Don't eat it, because when you eat it, um, you will die instantly. <laughs> if consumed. That's the text. Um, I've got one already in here. A Kairugu. And they're supposed to, when you get close to them, they're supposed to give off heat. It doesn't seem to work. Hey, wanna cuddle? Yeah, I now get heating like from the from the torch. That's interesting. Doesn't really work. Hypothermal insulation like seven. When get when I get close to you, it's still seven. That doesn't seem to be working. That's it for this ice base. I need to craft a bed. I hope I've got the materials for a bed. Let's see. I am searching for a bed. Needs wood batch. So that should be enough <laughs> bread. That should be enough for a single bed. I only need one. So and let's put it right here. And snow mountain base. I have to rebuild this check because for some reason uh Oh, I'm not in a house when I'm standing here. That's interesting. I need this door to be closed. So, let's get a door. Now I should be in a house. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> That's because the wind can actually get get through the door and cool you down. Now I should have a positive hit. Hypothermal insulation. You gonna hit me? It's, it's strange. It doesn't really work. That heating business. Anywho, I have bred a Giganotosaurus last time and it's good because he grew up. He's now adult. It only took me a week. <laughs> Real life week. But yeah, he grew up and he's good. Oh, my turrets are doing their job. That's good. Uh, not really. But here's my big boy. He's still bleeding real big time. Why? Because 
No one actually hit them, but when they when he grew up, when he grew up, um, he had like ten thousand health. Yeah, and it's slowly climbing up. But the game thinks now he that he took like damage and put the blood decals on him, even though he never took any damage. I would never do such a thing. Ah, uh, yes, yes, I remember that stuff has actually a spoil time. Yeah, I remember. Because it's organic and stuff, you know. So, let's actually put that, even though it's not really food, let's put it into special food. Because, because it's special. It doesn't, it doesn't go in here. Eh? Huh? Didn't it just say one minute? Heh! <laughs> I don't get this. Each time you transfer it from one container to another container? I, I don't I don't get that. <laughs> I don't get that. We have an anglerfish in the game, and I think the anglerfish is also an herbivore, an carnivore. And we're gonna check it out. Should we get a shark? A shark survives a bit more. Let's get a shark. Let's get this one. Also, equip new stuff. Close door. And let's fight an anglerfish. No idea if I'm gonna see one. They're they're glowing in the dark, sort of. <laughs> yeah, go ahead, fight. <laughs> yeah. This underwater cave totally doesn't look unnatural. <laughs> I've never checked out this underwater cave though. What is that? Do you see that? Sort of jumping out of the water. Oh, how did you get in? <laughs> it's funny, you can actually speed out of the water. Anywho, there's just oil here and crystals and pearls. No one needs that really. Let's actually drop that. Oh, I'm pressing the wrong button. Oh my god. Why am I pressing the wrong button? Look, I found one. Anglerfish level level 76. Oh, wow, he's quite big. I think you can tame them. No, no. Stay calm. Anglerfish should fall unconscious now. Any second now. Who did that sound? That didn't sound like an anglerfish. Where's the anglerfish? Where'd you go? Oh, there you are. Hello. Megalodon, please shut up. Okay, where's the anglerfish? Where's the freaking anglerfish? Where did he go? <laughs> where, where did the angler go? Anglerfish is gone. Come out, come out, wherever you are. 
Okay, I found another anglerfish. I hope I can get this time. I can get you this time. Uh, why are you going away? Oh, missed. Hey, angler. Hello, who attacks? Oh, now he attacks. That's interesting. He must have a really high torpor or something, I don't know. What's with all these uh, Ichthyosaurus? <laughs> you are distracting me, stop it. Hey, stop it. Angler. I don't want to kill you. But you are not going to sleep, aren't you? I mean, it's almost dead. I stop eating my shark. Maybe I have to hit him in the head or something. I don't know. Wait, that's a level 16? Wasn't that a level 76 before? Oh, I killed it. Great. <laughs> I have no idea how to tame them. <laughs> this is not really easy. Okay, I'm back in the ocean with m with the dolphin this time, or Ishtiosaurus, and as you could see briefly, I've brought a bodyguard. So, if a Plesiosaurus attacks me again, I'm going to have to give him a bad time. But I think that won't happen. Look at that. I caught another anglerfish. So, let's see if we can somehow make you go sleep. Give them a bad time, I don't know. You are dead? Oh, oh, that, oh shit, that was my anglerfish. Boom! Oh, I'm taking a bit of damage. Where's my bodyguard and stuff? Hey, would you go down there? Fight! Okay, and not now not fight and follow me. <laughs> That anglerfish is there. No, no, no. Don't fight. I have no idea how to tame this guy. Oh, that's a shark. What are you doing here? Anglerfish, anglerfish. Oh my god, I lost him. Oh, here he is. I wear that scuba gear stuff and still I have a hard time. Hey. You don't go out. That's the border, by the way. That floating stuff is the border of this arc. And I've killed it with Trank arrows. Okay, so uh, yeah, I have no idea. Maybe I have to read the wiki. Uh, can I somehow maybe move? Can I move? Oh, now I can move. Very good. Cooking more prime meat! Yay! Oh, look what we've got here. Thank you, Mrs. Giga. Very kind of you. Turns out, again, I'm completely out of narcotic and also completely out of. Um, where are they? With the drink arrows. So, <laughs> I have to craft a couple more. Glad I have a Brachiosaur that can harvest tons of narco berries for me and glad I have like tons in my Mosasaurus I have stacks of uh, rotten meat, not raw meat, which is that stuff. I have rotten meat. Sto tons of stuff. The angler gel when put into a standing torch will emit blue light 
at least the flare or the fire, not a flare. Let's see that. At least the flame will actually turn blue. So right now it's red. Let's get that stuff out. And put you in and it will actually last a very long time. Like in real life one hour and 13 minutes ish. I think and 100 times angl angler gel will actually like burn for five days. Oh yes and uh, yeah. Our Quasar here has now uh, has now hair and feathers. Yeah, this game got updated. They have now a so-called fur pass. That means like mammoth and saber tooth, wolves, all this kinds of stuff. They have now fur. Looks really good in my opinion. At least for the most part you have fur. Not this stupid like plain surface but real feathers. Okay, those are not really feathers, I think. Or are they? <laughs> Anywho, it looks really good. So, a couple of narco berries and a bit of uh, spoiled meat. I have stacks of spoiled meat and stacks of narco berries. Should do the trick, right? Uh, I hope so. Let's get a couple of arrows. Let's get just a little bit of narcotics and then we just need a little bit of time here are they uh, craft all 100 so that's 400 um, <laughs> drink arrows shouldn't take too long so I think now we should be all set I'll keep let's say yeah that many and uh, I'm gonna get just a couple 50 for the regular bow. Okay, now let's get back and try to tame that freaking dude, you know, that anglerfish. Yeah, it's called anglerfish. Put on my gas mask, <laughs> scuba gear, I mean. Yeah, and let's do it. Okay, check the surroundings. There's nothing around us. No enemies, nothing. Right. From the wiki they said this game currently has some bugs with the anglerfish that you have to constantly shoot them, wait, shoot them, I don't know. And look now it, now the game spawns enemies at you. Where did that guy go? Oh, I missed. Hello. Come here. Don't get shot actually. Can I hit you? Can I hit you? Okay. Wow, this is extremely laggy. Why is it so laggy? Where's my... Okay, there he is. Good. Apparently we have sun in the water. <laughs> Makes sense. Hmm. Oh, did he do it? Oh, great! Good lord, that took a while. <laughs> Okay, let's give you that. Maybe some narcotics. And if you can tame him. I mean, I have to be on my on my toes here. Don't let anything near it. I wonder why can't you not drag a body? You know, like that be an interesting thing if you could drag a body while it's unconscious. Why is that not a thing? I would drag it on, on land or something, or in safe uh, things. Oh, there's another anglerfish, see that? Why is that not a thing? That you can actually drag bodies, actually like only small bodies, you know? So the anglerfish, if you wanted the kibble, the anglerfish actually wants the, the karikuru egg kibble. So since I don't have any tamed Karikuros that can lay eggs right now, I don't have any kill. Okay, taming's on the go. That could take a while. <laughs> Still on the first bar. How comes that it a small fish like this takes uh, one and a half stack of narcotics? See that down to 36. I've shoved over 100 narcotics really into this guy, and it's, <laughs> it's taking a while actually. It's taking really long. 
Okay, my friends, we've got a little problem. Uh, it's not like enemies, but it's my last narcotics. And it's dropping already. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm going to board my trusty little dolphin here. Or big dolphin. We cannot have a map going. So I have to remember where this is. I have no idea where that is. It's far behind the red obelisk. Wow, I will never find this. <laughs> no, that's no way I'm gonna find this back. But yeah, let's let's try it out. I need more narcotics. So level 36 anglerfish requires like 500 narcotics. Before we proceed, I have to repair this guy again. Repair. Just to make sure, I'm gonna take 300. And that should be basically it. Maybe special food like the um, consume speed curry increased warmth, right? Yeah, let's take that. Okay, our friend is still there. There's a shark down there, but okay, let's give you a little bit more. Yeah, was kind of close. Let's make sure there's no shark nearby that could ruin my day. Yeah, like this guy. Stop annoying me. Hey, stop annoying me, I said. I'll die. Level 20 took three hits from my epic uh, pike. Yay, we've done it. Anglerfish. Oh, you look so nice. I really love it. Cool. So, we finally got a complete taming profile list again. Nice. So, this guy, I think you can put... You can ride? Brilliant! I can see perfectly because this, stupid, this scuba thing is still showing up even though I, I'm in third person. Can we eat? Very nice. Look at that cool thing. I love it. <laughs> I absolutely love it. Can this guy even see anything? Oh, that's so cool. He's bigger than I thought. Nice. I like that. How fast are you? I mean, it's a low level one. Sort of. But that's cool. And he's gonna illuminate like... Yeah, gives it a little... Of, gets off a little bit of light. Even though the ocean is always like a little bit bright. But no, that's really cool. Can you turn off the light? Let's see if it actually works. doesn't even work or does it no <laughs> it doesn't even work but the cool thing is you don't need to saddle for this guy like the wolves the wolves also don't need to saddle to ride on <laughs> the the light illumination is actually pretty decent if you ask me I really like that if I keep this if I keep the anglerfish here and you keep here and close the door so nothing evil can get inside. Maybe I don't even need the lights into my generator. Look at the look at the illumination level. How fitting it's it's night time. Let's go here and turn that guy off. Turn this guy up here. Turn it off. I mean okay, it's a bug. I think it's not intentional that the light from the anglerfish shines through the walls, but look how far it reaches. The light goes all the way to the to the wolf den. Look how far the light reaches. That's epic. Man, that, that's really epic. I tell you what. <laughs> I love this anglerfish. <laughs> nice. Okay, guys, that is it. See you again in the next Ark Survival episode. Uh, Ark Survival Evolved episode. Thank you so much for watching. Press the like button, subscribe to my channel. Goodbye.